Hello everyone. Welcome back to Tech Trends. In this video, we can see the problems which we face while displaying the content in LCD display. Let's get started. So these are the common LCD display problems. The first one is either you won't get any display or it will be a blank screen. And the second one is it will show incorrect characters or symbols in the LCD display screen. And the third one is the flickering display. Let's see one by one. The first one is no display or the blank screen. So the causes for this problem are incorrect wiring, incorrect I2C address or in insufficient power supply. And the solution is you need to check the wiring connections between the your board and the I2C converter. Also you need to use the correct I2C address as per your board. And also you need to verify the power supply which you provided is adequate or not. The second one is incorrect characters or symbols displayed. The reason for this problem is due to incorrect initialization sequence and also it might be due to incorrect contrast setting. So you may get the boxes like this in the LCD display. And the solution is you need to ensure the LCD is initialized properly in the program. Also you need to adjust the potentiometer in the I2C converter to get the correct display. And the final one is flickering display. This might be due to poor power supply. And the solution is you need to use the stable power supply to ensure the consistent voltage. Now let's see how to install the library. So you need to open Arduino IDE and go to tools and select manage libraries. And there search for liquid crystal and you will get the library name. So you need to click this install button and you need to install the library. Let me show you how to install. This is your Arduino IDE. Go to tools. Select manage libraries. Here search for liquid crystal. And click this install button. After installing the library from Arduino IDE, even after if you still face issues, uninstall that library and install the library given in this link. Let me show you how to install this. Copy this link in your browser. Click this zip file. Here you can see a download link. Click on that. Save the file. So this is a zip file, right click and select extract all. Click extract button. Now open the folder. So this is the library file. Now copy this folder and paste in documents, Arduino, libraries. You need to paste here. Then you can try the program. Now let me show you the circuit connection. So if you are using Arduino Uno, so you need to connect the ground from the I2C connector to ground in the Arduino Uno board, VCC to 5 volt, SDA from the I2C connector to pin number A4 and SDL to A5. If you are using ESP8266 or Node MCU, so you need to connect ground to ground, VCC to 3 volt or VU or V in pin, any of this, SDA to D2 and SDL to D1. And if you are using ESP32 board, you need to connect ground to ground, VCC to 3 volt, SDA to D21 and SDL to D22. So this is the program to get the I2C address. Let me show you how to get the I2C address. Now I am using Arduino Uno board. So this is the program. So first select the board. Here port is selected and also board is selected. Now click this upload button. Now the program is uploaded. Now go to serial monitor. Here select the baud rate as mentioned in the program. 
the baud rate is 9600 select this baud rate so here you can see the i2c device found at address 0 x27 so this is my i2c address so similarly you will get your board's i2c address so we need to use this address in the lcd program so this is my program so this is a simple program to print hello world in the lcd display so here i have used the i2c address 0x27 and 16 by 2 is the board type now again let's upload the program select the board here and click the upload button if you face this error change the line lcd dot begin of 16 comma 2 to lcd dot begin of blank then upload the program again now the program is successfully uploaded now we can check the output If you have any clarification, please mention in the comments. Please like this video and subscribe to Tech Trends. Thank you.